This is my first full day in Vancouver. Today is my first day of work at Aritzia. I am saying hello from my first weekend here in Vancouver. Out of menu, I'm here with Alicia. <laughs> Happy Monday everyone! This is my first full day in Vancouver. I just moved from Calgary yesterday, got all my things set up in my temporary accommodations courtesy of Aritzia where I'll be staying for the next week until I can move into my apartment in Cole Harbour. This is my first full day to explore and get to know the city. So I'm starting off by um, doing a little run by the waterfront. Um, I just called my mom this morning. Um, not gonna lie, it was a pretty rough morning, feeling pretty lonely, and I hope I'll be able to make new friends over the next few weeks and days here in Vancouver, which will be my new home. So I'll show you some views as we run. I'm gonna be running along Sunset Beach and Stanley Park today. So we just crossed that bridge over there. I'm about a kilometer into my run running along the water and hitting Sunset Beach and Stanley Park. Okay, I absolutely lost it. We passed the beach and there are palm trees here. It's so beautiful. halfway through my run and we're heading up Stanley Park. There are massive trees hanging over cliffs here. Back down to the beach, the ocean and mountains. Good morning, happy Tuesday. I am super excited to be starting. I'll be working in the project management office for Aritzia. Um, this is actually perfect because I just got my project management designation at the end of 2019. So this is a perfect fit for my career and I'm really excited to be starting um, growing my career in project management and also at Aritzia. I'm excited because Aritzia is, has been my favorite company since I have started shopping and getting into fashion. I remember as a teen, I've always aspired to have a lot of Aritzia clothes in my closet. I am honestly so grateful for the opportunity to be working at Aritzia. I remember when I was a teen and wanting to buy literally the whole store, but knew that my bank account could not support that decision. So as I grew older and started working more jobs, I was able to afford more pieces and having more items from Aritzia in my closet. What I really love about Aritzia um, and I started to love the brand more and more as I bought more items from there, um, was that they have a nice mix of fashionable pieces, so things that are on trend, currently in fashion, and changes each season, but they also have a lot of staple pieces, so you're not buying a whole ton of the same thing. Um, you can ha have like your staple items and also buy new pieces to spruce up your wardrobe um, as, as things change. Um, but also have your go-to pieces from there. So I really like that their clothes were high quality and dependable. They wouldn't break down after a couple washes, but things that you could rely on. So that became really important to me as I started working because I didn't want to be buying a whole ton of things as I started out at work, um, but was able to afford building and affording uh, more of a repertoire. I think both fashion and style are means to express yourself. I find a lot of joy in being able to put pieces together that I both own from either a long time or things that are new in fashion because I find that it's a way to use my creativity to express how I'm feeling that day and also display my confidence in how I want to portray myself to the world. So I think this is the perfect fit for me um, working at this company and I am so excited to share the journey with you. First day outfit. Just finished my first day of work having dinner at uh, the Flying Keg in Olympic Village. I ordered uh, the salmon with their dine out menu. I'm here with Alicia. <laughs> Just met her today actually. She's one of my friends that I met through Kelly, yes. one of my friends back at shop. Super exciting. I am back in my temporary accommodations place and I have finished my first day of work at Aritzia. It was so overwhelming in so many good ways. I'm really excited to be working there. Everything I've been learning so far has been really fun. I'm currently enrolled in Aritzia University, where I'll be learning about different principles and things in order to succeed and make the business thrive. So 
Um, learned a lot about the company through my first day and got to meet a lot of great people. Seems like the culture is great there. Everyone's very fun, young, and eager to help me as I learn through this process of getting onboarded. Many of them have come from retail jobs and have worked their way up to this corporate office. So it's nice to get to know them and understand like where they've been and all the different experiences they've had working on the retail floor since I haven't had that experience. So it's neat seeing it from the inside um, being a typical, typical consumer of Aritzia. And I am so excited to see where my career goes and the next steps for me there. So tomorrow's day two, I have dinner plans with my friend Varman. We're going to Miku, which I'm really excited about since I've heard all the rage about it. I'm excited to have more sushi. And in the meantime, now that it is nearly midnight my time, I've got some time to reply to some emails. Our first order is the Salmon Oshi Sushi. Do you want like a close-up of the... Sushi? Yeah. A wild sockeye salmon, yep. and then Hokkaido scallop, and then for the three oceans, so there's a normal piece of the salmon. Yeah. In the middle of the saba is a mackerel fish, mm -hmm. with these are and the eddy is a white tiger prawn with a Japanese prawn sauce. Cool. Happy Saturday everyone. I am saying hello from my first weekend here in Vancouver. I am meeting Alicia today for brunch in Granville Island. Just walking over there now and I'm excited to see that area because it'll be my first time going there. Uh, for the rest of the weekend, I have a couple plans including moving into my new apartment and spending some time with friends at the beach. It's oddly smoggy, smoggy, <laughs> smoggy and smoky here um, because of the wildfires in California and just generally the Pacific Northwest. So. I'm hoping everyone stays safe and the air quality clears up a little bit better and just in general that things get better here. So anyways, I'll keep you posted on the rest of the weekend. Like I said, really freaking smoggy here. You can barely see more than maybe a kilometer out. Saturday brunch at the breakfast table with Alicia. We're going to shoot after today. Oh, okay. Uh, but he's just like, yeah, me and my like, kind of dependent on him because they live together. Um, like clothes and stuff like that. But I don't know if he's gonna shopping or something else. Yeah. What's that? I don't remember. Okay, okay so we don't want a regular. Regular fries? Okay. okay that's, so. that's fine. Yeah, thanks. Wait. I should have said that. Why? Because I don't like this language. 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 I have friends. I have Russian friends. Hi and good morning and welcome to my new apartment here in Cole Harbor, Vancouver. Today is my soft move-in day which means that I just have a couple of groceries and I'm living out of the two luggages that I have been for the last two weeks or so. I am going to be getting my furniture later this week so hopefully I'll be more settled in in about a week's time so I'll keep you posted and give you a tour just to get started. Right, so starting out at the entrance, we've got the closet for coats and things over here. The kitchen is right behind us. This is the living room. I'm gonna get my couch set up over there. And we are overlooking the harbor. And when it's not too smoky of a day or too smoggy, you can see the mountains right behind the trees. That is kind of visible in this video. Moving on, the next room we have is the sunroom. Again, kind of a less sunny day here in Vancouver because of the wildfires that are happening in the West Coast. So I hope get, things get to clear up in the next little bit and also that from an environmental perspective, they stop happening and people can get back to breathing normal quality air. This is the bathroom. Hola. And now we're moving into the bedroom. In here, we've got a walk-in closet, very important for me. 
as I'll be ordering a lot of clothes from Aritzia for work. My bedroom, thanks to my friend Grady for lending me his air mattress, which is what I'll be sleeping on for the next little bit. And again, the same view, we've got the harbor, mountains, and the ocean. All right, now we are on the hunt for some things that I need. I don't have any soap, shower curtains, Lysol wipes, and a couple other things to get me started until my furniture comes in and my other things arrive from the moving company. So I'll take you on a little journey through Vancouver. We're going to Granville Street, which is apparently where all the things I need would be, including Aritzia. Um, maybe I'll go shopping a little bit later before I head out to meet a friend for coffee. So enjoy the little tour. We're at HomeSense and I finally figured out what I wanted. I got a pillow for sleeping on the air mattress tonight. Uh, between pink and blue, our theme for the bathroom is blue, totally classic. Um, got a shower liner because I haven't decided on a curtain yet. We've got these gem curtain hooks and some soap, again for the bathroom. It is the end of my first weekend here in Vancouver. I almost said Calgary. Um, I just finished grabbing all the things that I need for this week, running some errands, and I have enough to get set up here um, until my furniture and other things arrive. So we're ending the weekend off with a workout. I'm so thankful that my apartment has a gym. So I'm just gonna do a little 360 so that you can see what's good. So we've got some weights and other things that I will be needing for my workout. There is also a pool, a little plunge pool and some cardio machines. So I got to figure out what I'm going to be doing today. Haven't run in a, about a week, so I'll probably get back to that tomorrow. I think I'm going to be joining Run Club, the East Van Run crew. So I'll let you know how that goes. And today I will probably be doing back glutes and abs, just a classic quarantine workout, but with uh, actual weights in a gym. So see ya. We're going to get this uh, air mattress done. Creating that vision here, obviously on an air mattress, but better than nothing. Thank you again, Grady, for lending me your air mattress for the next couple days. Um, got a nice pillow from HomeSense earlier today. No pillowcase, but it'll be better than nothing. And I knew this Aritzia scarf would come into play in another way, apart from just being my my scarf. Not just keep me warm outside, but also inside, actually as the diamond blanket scarf. Emphasis on the blanket. It'll be keeping me warm here tonight. <laughs>